In this special Law of Attraction video, we're going to share three absolutely astonishing keys to manifesting anything you desire. Hi everybody, Robert Zink, Miracle Mentor and Alchemy Life Coach. And today, we are soaring high like a big, beautiful eagle flying in the direction of your dreams and your goals. I'm excited to share these three keys because what these three keys do is they take everything all the stuff that you've been learning about the law of attraction through books and audio programs and YouTube channels and podcasts and everything else. And they bring it all together, all together into three keys, astonishing keys that if you will follow, if you will wake up every day, every single day and say, what are the three keys? Maybe even have them written on your mirror. These are the three keys. And if you'll practice them, I promise you, you will begin to manifest like you've never manifested before. You will attract like you've never attracted before. The law of attraction will be working with your goals, with your dreams and your desires like never before. The first key is desire. Nothing is about to happen in your life without desire. I mean, you can be lying in bed. And if you don't desire to get up, nothing's going to happen. You have to have at least a desire to get out of bed. But that's, that's such a small desire. Real manifestors, high flyers like yourself, they have a burning desire. It's in your heart. It's in your gut. It's in your dreams. That desire just, it won't leave you alone. Perhaps it's a business that you desire to build or a relationship that you desire to take to the next level. Or perhaps it's your career. Maybe you're a writer or an actor. You have a message to give. Perhaps you're a life coach and you want to reach more people. Whatever it is, you just can't. It's like a hunger. You can't give it up. It's, it's there all the time. When you have this desire, you have turned the first key into the first lock. The Upanishads say, as is your desire, so is your will. As is your will, so is your deed. As is your deed, so is your destiny. I like that. As is your deed, your action. But all that action started with desire. Action is important. We'll get to that in a moment. But first, in order to make that action take place, there has to be a burning, absolutely fervent desire for whatever it is you wish to manifest. One of the things you can do is you can say to yourself, what would happen if I didn't do this? How would I feel? If I don't do what I'm called to do, if I don't become what I'm called to become, if I don't create what I'm called to create, then what? And you're going to see a void. You're going to see an absolute void. You're going to see a life of mediocrity and boredom. I believe you deserve more but I can't do it for you. Your wife can't do it for you. Your husband can't do it for you. No one can do it for you but you. It begins with a hunger, a burning desire. What is it that you truly desire in your life? What is it you truly want to put your life into, your energy into, your fire into? your passion into. Desire is the first key to manifesting anything you want. 
Napoleon Hill said, the starting point of achievement is desire. Everything begins with desire. Everything starts with desire. So maybe take a day off. Maybe close the doors and shut the windows. Maybe go to a cabin and lock yourself away. Spend a little time with yourself and ask yourself one question. What is it that I truly, absolutely desire? The second key to manifesting anything you desire is belief. Look at you can desire something. You can desire to build a new business. You can desire to build a multi-million dollar company. You can desire to be a great actor or writer or artist. But if you don't believe it, that desire just burns and it irritates you. It's like pouring acid on your skin. It just hurts all the time because you have the desire, but you don't have the belief. The second key is equal to the first key. The first key is desire. The second key is your belief. I believe. Start with those two words and take what you don't believe or what you have doubts in and turn them into beliefs. I believe that money flows to me easily, effortlessly on a daily basis. Perhaps that's your money affirmation and it's designed to increase your beliefs that money is easy to make. I believe that I am in an incredible, loving, happy relationship. Perhaps that could be your relationship belief. I know what you're, you're saying. You're saying, Robert, you're just lying to yourself. Not really. You see, what your subconscious mind believes becomes your reality. It becomes your vibration. It becomes what you put out. And that's what comes back to you. So it's not lying to yourself. It's adopting a new belief. The moment you doubt whether you can fly, you cease forever to be able to do it. Jim Barry from Peter Pan. I have seen people go into business with nothing more than belief. Many years ago, a long time ago, in a different lifetime, many years ago when I was a young man, I was working for a television station that went bankrupt. My best friend and partner, who was also a marketer, a broadcaster, he was out of work. Times were tough. The economy was slow at the time. We were out having a cup of coffee one day. And I said, why don't we start our own, our own business, our own advertising agency? And he says, how much money do you have, Robert? He said it facetiously. And I said, well, I've got about $15 to my name. And, and he says, well, I have about the same amount. So between us, we had $30. We went down to the county city building we got a business license. The business license cost us $28. We put $2 in his car for gas and we were now in business. Now we didn't have any tools. We didn't have any business cards. We didn't have any letterhead. We didn't have any stationery. We didn't have an office. We didn't have a telephone. We had nothing, but we had one thing. We had belief. By the end of the day, we put $4,000 in our bank account with new clients. By the end of the week, we put close to $10,000 in our bank account. We rented an office. We hired an artist. We put in a phone line. We ordered some business cards and we were in business. 
We sold that business, part of it off, about three years later. But during that period of time, we billed close to a million dollars in three years. That was back in the 70s. And we did it with only belief, nothing more. Look at if I can do it, I know you can do it. You have more tools. You have a computer. You have a phone. You have everything you need to build your business, to build your relationship, to build your life the way you desire. But you're going to have to grab on real tight and say, no more doubt. No more fear. I'm into belief now. And every affirmation must be designed to increase your belief. First in yourself. Secondly, in your mission and your goal. Whatever the mind of man can conceive and believe, it can achieve. The third key that you absolutely must turn is action. So the first key was desire. You have to have that burning desire, that gnawing in you all the time. The second key was absolute confidence and belief in yourself. And the third key is action. There is no attraction without action. Nothing moves. Nothing changes. There must be daily action. Daily action in the direction of your dreams, your goals, your desires. That's what gets the universe and all the energy moving, is your action. You've put out the intention, you have the desire, you have the belief, but now you've got to get movement going. And that requires taking action. A phone call, a trip, ordering new business cards, an apology, whatever it is you need to do to get the energy flowing. Do you want to know who you are? Don't ask. Action will delineate and define you. Think about that. Action will delineate and define you. That's Thomas Jefferson. And Thomas Jefferson was saying that every action you take if I take up this action to go this way, I'm delineating the past over here. But I'm defining myself in the future, going this direction. You define yourself not by what you say. You define yourself by your actions. Because your action and your vibration go hand in hand in creating an unstoppable force to attracting whatever you desire. Action is the fundamental key to all success. Pablo Picasso. Think about it. Right now. Ask yourself, as soon as this video is over, am I going to sit down and watch another 10? Or am I going to get off YouTube just for a moment and take some action? Or maybe your action is to stay on YouTube and look up some specific information on how to improve your acting, how to improve your writing, how to improve your business, how to market your business more successfully. Whatever your action is, take it now. Do it now. Right now. Come on. Why wait? This is your moment. This is your time. You have three keys now. You have them, write them down. Key number one, desire. Key number two, belief. Key number three, action. Take some action. Enjoy the life that you deserve. Have a great day now because you deserve it. Bye-bye.